Hey guys, it's Puny here. Just wanted to do a quick unbox video for a tablet I recently purchased. Uh, today we'll be looking at the Xiaomi Mi Pad 5 Pro, which was, I believe, released in August of this year. Main reason for wanting to get this tablet was because I recently got into mobile games and I wanted to be able to stream the games as well. And since my old tablet was not capable of doing that, I pretty much had to get a new one. The second reason was because I used to do some drawing in the past and I was curious to know if I could bring back those drawing skills. So hopefully this tablet does what I need it to do. And yeah, I'm pretty excited to make use of it, see what happens. In case anyone was wondering, my old tablet was the Samsung Galaxy Tab S 10.5 inches. It was a pretty good tablet during that time of year, but that was seven years ago, so I figured it's time for an upgrade anyway. So this video was mostly to show my friends what I got and on the side show others what they can expect to see if they decide to purchase this tablet as well. But before we get into the actual unboxing, I do want to apologize for the video quality. I am using my webcam to record this and my only other option is my phone, but I was worried that the sound quality might not be that good. So I think this is the best setup that I can get at this point. Uh, one thing to point out, the charger doesn't come with the tablet. This was purchased separately. You technically can use a Type-C charger if you already have one. I just decided to get the charger from the same company to guarantee effectiveness. During the embossing, I will put specifications on the side of the screen for you guys to refer to, but I won't actually review the tablet afterwards since this was meant to be just an unboxing video. If this video gets enough attention, I will consider a review video after some usage of the tablet. So yeah, let's get right into it. Okay, so time to uh, showcase what was in the package. Um, the packaging was done really well. Uh, they used some kind of plastic sort of bubble wrap without the bubbles, I guess. Uh, so no damage to the exterior of the tablet's um, casing, if you will. Uh, we have this art appreciation sort of advertisement. Ink painting is China's traditional culture. It has thousands of years of history by the people's favorite. Thank you for shopping from our store. Now we are launching Collect a store free gift available plus discount. And then there's like a QR code at the bottom there. I'm assuming this is just uh, something from the vendor that I bought the tablet from. Uh, anyways, got two little wet wipes here. You're probably not going to use that, but sure. Um, so first impression, uh, the casing looks really nice. Uh, looks like one of those you know, Ferrero Rocher chocolate boxes, if you will. Uh, so yeah, let's go ahead and open that up. Okay, so it looks like it came with a screen protector, from what it looks like. Probably just gonna keep that in there for now. And now for the tablet itself. Just have to be careful with this. Okay. So here we are. So here's the tablet in its glory. Uh, hopefully you guys can see that. I'll just bring it a little closer here. There you are. Looks like a notebook on the outside. I can, I can, I don't even, I can't even tell where's the screen, honestly. Like, I'm assuming this entire black, uh, almost the entire black area is the screen, I'm assuming. But uh, yeah, there you go. There's, uh, this is the front side. This is the back side. Got the cameras in the corner there. Oh, there's a plastic covering at the moment, I just haven't taken it out yet, but yeah. 
pretty light. Uh, I think I feel like it's almost the same weight as my old tablet. Not much difference there. So this was the lid. Uh, in case anyone was curious. And uh, underneath the tablet, we have a little pa uh, packaging here. Contains, I don't know. Oh, headphone. USB type C to 3.5 millimeter jack uh, headphone adapter. So that's kind of nice in case people want to use it to listen to music. It's good that they included that since nowadays new devices don't contain the jack anymore. Um, I'm assuming this is like some kind of instruction manual, but it's all in Chinese. Uh, I can sort of read it, but it's okay. I think I think we're experienced enough to know how to use the tablet without instructions, hopefully. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much it. Right, this was the bottom side of the packaging. Got the little space there. Or the small box that contained the instruction manual and the adapter. Uh, nothing else underneath. So yeah, that's pretty much it. This was the Xiaomi Mi Pad 5 Pro. Hopefully this video helps some people get a good idea of what to expect if they decide to buy this tablet as well. And yeah, thank you so much for watching. And I will see you guys in the next video.